welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome so um i'm gonna tell you guys i sat down to record my youtube video for the day um it's gonna be uh the glassy guys from season eight yeah well i was getting them all set up so i could look at them on my chromebook and I made a huge mistake. If you guys watched my video from yesterday, I did the Degrassi guys, the new guys from season seven. And I always say that it's the people that were added to the main cast from season seven. Well, if you're smarter than me, you would have noticed that I actually forgot two people. I forgot Danny and Derek. Um, so I did Damien and I forgot, ah, forgot Danny and Derek. Um, so there's that. So I am actually going to make this a separate video. It's going to be tired of something like, oh my God, I forgot these two characters in my Degrassi season seven video or whatever, something like that. Um, and then the next video will be the Degrassi guys added to season eight and again I made a mistake I said there was only five guys so there's actually eight if there was one more I would have to have split them into two separate families why did like eight guys and I'm pretty sure uh, we have Kelly useless character um, Bruce useless character um, blue another useless character so there's that yeah um you might be w wondering but johnny's also a useless character johnny is not a useless character in my degrassi revival series i actually added johnny because i actually love johnny i find him a character hmm. i love johnny um, he made some questionable mistakes, but once he, uh, cut his hair, he became really mature, and he <laughs> was dating when we saw him again in, in, um, college when Allie ran away, and Allie trusted him enough, which was nice. So, there's that. So, let's get into it. And I fixed the issue with the sound, um, and I know I showed him again. I'm not going to show off his outfits, but this is Damien. Um, and again, he is an academic, a quick learner, um, perfectionist, and smart. And I did give him a couple of likes. He likes beaches and debate, rocket science, robotics. We actually met him when he was um, debating against Degrassi. He was like, Ross versus Degrassi in the debate, I think. No, we met him at... I mean, I don't actually remember. And he just likes video games. I have no idea why I did that. I'm actually... I'm gonna get rid of them all. Oh! I updated Wicked Whim. No. Yes. Wicked Whims. I updated Wicked... Whims. No, Wonderful Whims. I don't have Wicked Whims anymore. It's Wonderful Whims. So now I can actually give my Sims preferences based on attractiveness. And I'm gonna do that for my main um, Degrassi Revival series. So... Um... I wish you could, like, clear them all, but I have to actually go in. Oh, and then it bumps me back to the top. I hate when it does that. Okay. And... There. So, I'm not thinking anymore. Because I didn't give anyone else any, so I'm not going to do that. Okay. But we have to get through this quick, because I don't want this to be a super long video. So, um, we will start with Danny Van Zandt. Now, I was all excited because finally I get to use some, like, afro hairs because when he was introduced, he had this huge afro. But, as I always say, I do them based on the season they were added to the main cast. So, that's why a lot of characters end up looking a lot older um, when I create them than, like, some of them. Like, I created Emma, and she looks like a child. But then I create, like, Jay, and he's a full-on adult because he was added after he was expelled. And, like, with Maya, 
she looks like a child. But he was added in season seven. Uh, he still had an afro, but it wasn't just as it wasn't as a uh, voluminous. I hate myself. Voluptuous. Volu Don't come at me, please. Okay. Um. So let's name him Danny. Dan, Dan. And I'm also going to try to, for my Dugasic Bravo series, I'm going to try to give everyone the relationships that they need. Um, it's kind of hard. I have to do a lot of cheats to do that. And, like, with, um, with Toby and Ashley, I actually can't make them step-siblings. I have, um, MC Command Center, which allows me to add a relationship. But I can either only um, do um, the intimate relationships like brother, sister, or I can make them cousins. So, okay, so by season, in season seven, he was really into his music. Um, I'm not going to make him a musical genius. I don't know. What do you want to do with your life? Um, he and uh, Danny were very mischievous. I mean, he's Danny. Him and Derek. I'm gonna make him chief of mischief. Um. And uh, these are hobbies. Maybe I can get from like a a musical a music lover. That works. Um. And he was a little childish. Now, by season 8, he had matured a lot. Especially after what happened um, with Derek in the um, when he um, stopped being friends with Derek because what Derek did in the mall. Cause to De and I know where Derek was coming from. To Derek, it was just a joke. Um, he wasn't trying to do that to Danny. Which is kind of horrible, but it's kind of also that Derek it never crossed Derek's mind that that could be an issue because um, Derek doesn't see that with Danny. He just sees him as his best friend. Um, but So I don't know what skin tone I gave Liberty. Now, of course, they're not actually brother and sister in real life, so they have different skin tones. But uh, I guess that's good. Um, now, what color are your eyes? I just need to remember so you wear long sleeve polos, jeans, um, and you have brown eyes and black hair. So we'll do that. Maybe not that voluptuous. That's my new word. If that's not the right word, I don't care. It's my word. Um, and I, I always give my sims the same eyebrows. I really need to stop. It's just, I find the eyebrows I give everyone, like, the most sensible. I mean, probably, I mean, he has some thin eyebrows. So I'm gonna give him those. Uh, okay. So he's just... He does still have, like, an afro-type hair. Um, in season 7, it's just not as massive. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. I really want to give him, like, braids. Why do nobody in Degrassi have these? Actually, Marco had them for a while. Which, really weird, because Marco's white. Actually, he's Italian. I think the actor who plays Marco is Italian. Because his name is Regiro. No, I, I can't. Uh, I need to stop. I mean, it's got a ponytail, but that... It's not that far off. Oh, why do I not have any? I don't have any afros for dudes. I'm like really tempted to give him one of these girl afros. Because I just don't have. I 
I mean, I could... Oh, there we go. I do. Not that much. Actually... That's how much air he has. I'm just putting it out there. Yeah, I'm going to go for that one. Because the other one I gave Jimmy, and Jimmy didn't have as much hair. Yeah, okay. Um. So we will move on. Um. He was actually kind of skinny. He was a slim kid. Oh, I didn't give him eyelashes. I will, though. Um, now, he was wearing, like, a polo. But, like, a long sleeve polo. And I know we have something like it. I guess this, oh, that looks, that's perfect. And then we just give him some jeans. Nope. I also give all my guys some of these same jeans because all my others are skinny. Um, and then we'll just give him some, like, Converse, I guess. Perfect. Now we just have to give him some eyelashes and he'll be good to go. Perfect. And there's Danny. Real quick, we'll go and give him some other outfits. Now for formal, he's not the type that puts much effort into it. So we're just going to give him... I don't know, something like that. <laughs> Again, I love doing the guys more than doing, like, the girls. Because with the guys, I don't have to change their hair depending on their outfits. Which is nice, because with the girls, I would always have to change their hair depending on their outfits. That's too much. Um, and again, I'll go back and do his, um, head. Um, yeah, that's fine. And we'll give him some little joggers. I don't really like those. Those, those look a little better, not by much. I just, I also want to know why the Sims pants are all, like, low cut, like, Nobody wears low-cut pants. I mean, I guess people do. But most people like high-cut, high-waisted. So, okay. Then we got sleepwear. That's fine. We'll just put them in blue, though. So, for his party look... Um, he seems like the kind of guy to kind of just wear this. That seems like his little style, along with his, um, Converse. Swimwear. Yeah, that is okay. Hot weather. Mmm. Yeah, that looks fine, and, uh, give him some shorts, and some, um, skater shoes, with some socks, and then cold weather. That looks fine. Um, I 
and probably yeah we'll just put those on and then we'll go take the away all the jewelry that is generated on him Okay, and there is Danny Van Zandt. So next we're gonna add his BFF, turned ex-BFF, Derek. So, Derek Hag. Um, and again, oh no, uh, he enjoys a good mischief. Oh, I gotta turn him into a teen. Um, hmm. Um, I don't know. We didn't know him much. Definitely make him childish, though. Hmm. Now maybe we'll make him a little slow-witted. Okay. So we will go do his face. And he also has a little, um, afro. Him and, uh, Danny were called, like, the afro. <laughs> I don't actually think that's what they're called, but someone always made the remark that, uh, they both had afros. Um, I think it was, um, one of the teachers, Perino, I think it was him. So, he has brown hair and green eyes. So, uh, he has green eyes, that's a little creepy. Hmm. Maybe if I change his eye shape. Okay. Oh, we gotta do his skin, so he's a lot paler. Uh, not that pale. Oh, that's perfect. We'll do his hair. Now, it's gonna be harder for him because he's white, so I can't really give him the Ebonox hair. Because it only comes in black, and he has brown hair. I uh, wish I had curly hair for guys. I don't. I give him this. Cause it's kinda like the the height of it, it's just not curly, but I don't have curly hair for guys. I have this hair. And that does not work. Should have downloaded some stuff before I did this, but I forgot about these guys. Yeah, I just, it's not good. And again, he's also very thin. And let's see what we got for him. Oh, and then in season eight, he also cut his hair, which is nice, but yeah. Um... 
to get from this, I guess. That seems about, that seems like a good outfit. And same jeans. And we'll give them these, I guess. Okay, so formal. He would also probably not dress too fancy as well. So maybe this. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's good. And just some jeans, I guess. And that, but we need to add some socks. So active. that and that so sleepwear The pants are okay. Remove the slippers. So, for party, I don't know. I'm gonna give him this, I guess. And that. And we'll give him some socks. And the shoes. Swimwear. That's fine. Hot weather. Give him that. That's okay, I guess. And we'll give him the skater shoes as well. With some socks and then cold weather, we will give him this. Maybe I'll change his. Yeah. Yeah, that's better. So now I just go and remove everything. There he is. I wanna. Okay, there's Derek. So that was it that I had for them. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. And don't come at me for completely forgetting about these two guys. I'm using Wiki, I'm using Wikia, and it only says if they're, um, if they're added to the main cast, it doesn't mark them as new, because technically they've been in the show before, so it's really hard to remember when they were added to the main cast, especially when you've seen the show so many times, and you've seen them in their episodes so many times, but right after this video is posted, I will 
uh, well, the same day, I'm going to get the Degassi Guys of Season 8 out. Um, what I might do, though, because there are eight guys in that video, I'm probably going to just do their main outfits and then stop recording and then do their outfits by myself and then just show you guys. Because there's eight. Doing every single outfit is going to take forever. So. Don't forget to like the video and then I will see you all next time. Bye.